My name is Drew Land. Welcome to my vlog where I help equip you for a meaningful life. We are in the middle of a money series based on my book, The Money Verse. We're going to answer the questions right now. How should I handle my money? The famous preacher John Wesley once said, make all you can and save all you can so you can give all you can. And I love that sentiment. And I think there is an order in how we are meant to handle our money. Proverbs 24, 27 says, prepare your work outside, get everything ready for yourself in the field. And after that, build your house. There's a sequence with your money that will help you. And I talk about it in my book, First, you're going to start with making the money. You know, I'm going to help you learn to make more money. So make money. Then you are going to give some money away. Then you are going to save money and only then will you spend money. If you will get that sequence right in your mind and in your habits every single month, you will start to win when it comes with money. You make it, then give it, then save it, then spend it. That is a formula that works. Let me tell you how much I'm expecting you to give and how much I recommend you save and then spend. And now this always blows everybody's mind when I tell you what I'm going to advocate now. After your money comes in, when you make it, you're now going to take 10% of that and you're going to give it away. Now I give that amount to my church and I give beyond that and I have a chapter about tithing in my book if you want to know more about that particular subject. But give 10% of it away. You find over and over again people who do well with money are generous with money. Start to be generous. Give 10% of your income away and you'll start to see God blesses you with the wisdom of how to know how to use the rest. Then you're going to save 15%. That's right. 15%. Again, most people think there's no way I could save 15%. Well, it might be that you need to earn a little bit more. That's why I'm going to do a vlog on making more money, helping you. You might need to earn more, but actually, if you will learn to spend wisely, you would be amazed how much you can actually save. So we're going to talk around spending as well, but you're going to have a target of saving 15%. If you can't hit that target right from the beginning, that's okay. I'm gonna teach you how to do those steps and what to do later on. But then you're going to live in what I call the 75% zone. You're going to only spend 75% of your income. As your income grows, obviously that 75% grows as well. And now you're able to even live on less. Even now, my wife and I are looking to sell our house, not to upgrade, to downgrade, so that we can learn to spend wisely, so that we can give more away and save more. You can do the same thing as well. So those are some tips right now. Get that in your mind on how you can handle your money better. We're going to teach you how to do all of those things. Stay tuned. Please subscribe to this channel so you can get it weekly. And then go to drewland.org, find out about the money verse. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, the social media stuff. And we'll see you next time. And we will equip you even more on how to have a meaningful life.